I want to welcome you back to Black Sight tonight. We're going to talk about Brett Miller from Kings and Queens has been arrested for family A. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel, hit that like button, hit that notification button, but also comment on this video. Brett Miller last night on a deleted live at three in the morning went upside of Rose Miller's head and her son tried to break it up. He has been arrested by the Honolulu PD. It's on the docket. It says he was arrested. He seems like he has had enough of Rose. Rose just a month ago emasculated him on video. And it seems like her mouth is getting her in trouble. I thought her marrying this white man would do better for her. She has spent her whole channel talking down to black men, saying black men weren't good enough, especially the man that created the children who happened to be black before Brett. But it seems like her reckless mouth got her in enough trouble with Brett to the point to where you could see on video he jumped up and went at her. So I guess she called the cops, which a woman like Rose will always do after she runs her mouth, basically trying to get this man to react to her. But this huge white man did react to her. And I wonder what he did to get arrested because you have to write down the police officers have to write down what happened that night. So it seems like he's in jail right now, probably waiting to bail because of what she has done. This woman is the problem. I don't think Brett is a bad guy. I really don't. And the other black man that she had children with probably wasn't a bad guy. It seems like this woman may have some mental problems that need to be addressed. This is not a good atmosphere for those children to be around. When you have a woman like this who's constantly running that mouth on YouTube, constantly talking down to black men, constantly saying that black men are no good. They have all these problems, but the problem seems to be with you because one thing that we have in common with this whole issue with Rose is that this white man and that black man has a serious problem with her. And the one common denominator is you. I think Rose needs to get some mental help. I think she needs to go see a doctor somewhere, sit on a couch for a couple of hours, and express herself because I feel that this woman is dangerous. She's not only going to get herself hurt, but eventually she's going to get her children hurt. And I hope that CPS comes to the door finally and says enough is enough. Because these women are starting to make YouTube into a mockery. They're here to make money, yes. But they have children and they have families. And I wonder what Brett is going to say. Because she's going to say, like she did say, she loved her husband. But the man had to go to jail. Because of what you were saying and what you were doing. You probably poke poke and poke at this man every damn day. And he simply had enough. Just like the first man, the black man, the black man that you constantly go after every day on YouTube probably said he had enough. And he had to move on. And he had nothing that he wanted to do with you at all. This is not a good look because the white savior, the white man that you love so much, the white man that does so much better than the black man is the one who attacked you and the one that is sitting in prison right now. Rose is an evil woman.
I'm just telling you that right now. She's one of those women who sit around all day and wonder what she can do to a man and how she can destroy him and how she can emasculate him, how she can humiliate him. And that's what she did to Brett. And one thing about a white man, when he gets mad, he goes off. And he went off the deep end, it seems like, this time. This is why she had him arrested. She couldn't control his anger. And why would he? She is a bad woman. She, he, I, one thing I'm going to tell Brett, he should have just walked away. Because we don't know how their relationship really is. She seems like one of those women who constantly, I repeat, constantly gets on his last nerve. And it seems like he just had enough. And he said, I'm done. And basically, she kept pushing, kept pushing, kept pushing. And Brett said, hell no, I'm going off. And right now, Brett is in some serious trouble. You know, some jurisdictions don't play when it comes to this type of abuse. For what she has done to this man. And this is sad to watch. But she wanted a white man. She got him. She said the white man was better. She talks down to the black man. But your white man ain't delivered. He even has done worse. So what's going down? He's got to pay money for a lawyer. He's got to pay money to the court because of her. This is a no good woman. And no man will ever be happy with this woman. He might as well go ahead and move on himself like the black man moved on. But I don't know if he's got nothing to offer because they making money off of this channel. They're going to make money off of this incident. But I do know he should just go ahead and move on. It's not going to get better for you, brother. I'm telling you as a man, some women are just no good. They're Jezebels. They will start trouble no matter who they're with. And she seems like she's one of them. It's not going to get better, Brett. Leave her alone and move on to the next person. I would love to hear your comments in the comment section. I want to thank you for listening to Black Sight. Hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.